the power of this BJP is only winning elections and mainly in the heartland states of Hindi and what we generally call as the Gomutra states. Gomutra states. So, I think that the Sanatani Parampara is a very big miracle. This is a good mindset. In the recent parliament winter session, DMK MP Dr. D. N. V. Santil Kumar fired a pot shot at Prime Minister Modi rule central government soon after the five states assembly polls stating that BJP can win elections in only Gomutra states. This is the first instance where we see a state being converted into a union territory. And what is the main reason behind it? The BJP has just won many of the state elections and they've come into this house. They see themselves and their strength is always seen as winning elections after elections and going after micromanagement. But what happens in Jammu and Kashmir? Why are they not able to do that? Since they are not able to do that, they bring a state into a union territory where they can have control over the governor and then they can run the governance through that. If they were capable and if they were very confident of winning Jammu and Kashmir, would they have gone in for a union territory? So that is the main reason that the people of this country should think that the power of this BJP is only winning elections and mainly in the heartland states of Hindi and what we generally call as the Gomutra states. The DMK MP's comments were met with strong criticism from the BJP. His remark triggered a fresh controversy as several parliamentarians demanded his apology. I think that the Sanatani Parampara is a very big miracle. And what do you think of the Gomutra? Maybe the DMK will come to understand it. क्योंकि वो अच्छी तरह जानते हैं कि ये फ्रस्ट्रेशन जो है सनातनी परंपराओं की सनातनियों की देश बर्दाश्त नहीं करेगा और चाहे वो डीएम के हो या कोई भी हो जो देश की आस्थाओं के साथ खिलवाड़ करेगा देश की जनता इकट्ठा होकर उसको मुंतोड़ जवाब जरूर देगी नहीं वो दिखाई दे रहा है जी एक 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 साजिश के तहत ये सब कार्य किए जा रहे हैं लेकिन शायद इनको अंदाजा नहीं है कि इस प्रकार की भाषा का जो दुर्भाषा का प्रयोग कर रहे हैं देश की जनता उसे बिल्कुल बर्दाश्त नहीं करी है जवाब इनके सामने आएगा भाजपा का एक्सेप्टेबल ऑल इंडिया में है इसलिए उत्तर पूर्वांचल से सूरत करके अभी साउथ में भाजपा का राज गोवा में है तो इसलिए जम्मू कश्मीर में है तो वो जो बोलता है उनका कोई ध्यान नहीं जानकारी नहीं है वो बोलने वाला बोल देते हैं उसमें हमारा क्या आ सकता है लेकिन गाय माता के ऐसे गोमुत्र से इस तरीके से तुलना करना कि देखिए वो हिंदुस्तान का कल्चर जानते नहीं है इसे बोलते हैं बोलने वाला बोलने दीजिए लेकिन जनता किसका पति सदाय है विश्वास किसको पास है भाजपा का पास है हमारा आदरणीय मुख्य प्रधानमंत्री नरेंद्र मोदी आज हिंदुस्तान का लीडर नहीं वाल वाल का लीडर बन गया उन्नयन का मुख मुखौटा बन गया इसलिए उनका बात में कुछ नहीं आ सकता ये अच्छी मानसिकता का परिचायक है और जब ये लोग कहीं नहीं आते हैं तो निश्चित रूप से इस तरह की बात करके हमें लगता है कि जो बयान इनका है बहुत ही अच्छी है और ये पब्लिक ये जनादेश है राज्य की जनता ने विश्वास किया है राज्य की जनता ने वोट दिया है भारतीय जनता पार्टी को और देश की जनता का भरोसा देश की जनता का विश्वास भारतीय जनता पार्टी पर है आदरणीय मोदी जी पर है आज हम विकसित भारत की संकल्पना जो आज कर रहे हैं निश्चित रूप से लोग ये देख रहे हैं कि आज विश्व के स्तर पर विश्व के पटल पर भारत की एक मजबूत दमदारी मजबूत उपस्थिति है और भारत हर हर एक स्थिति में आज जी का समिट अगर हम देखें तो कितने मैंने बहुत अच्छे ढंग से जी ट्वेंटी सबमिट हुआ और जो बीस देश के जो प्रतिनिधि आए बिल्कुल उन्होंने सराहा तो कुछ ऐसे बहुत छोटे मानसिकता वाले लोग हैं जिनको ये सब पसंद नहीं आता ये सब ये जो आज लोकप्रियता देश देश ही नहीं विश्व के अंदर आदरणीय प्रधानमंत्री जी की बढ़ रही है उससे लोग तिलना Later, the DMK MP apologized and also said that if these remarks have hurt someone's feelings, then he would not use it again. There was no controversy. There is no statement such as that, and it's not something like after Sanandana and this thing or not. See, I made uh, some statement inside the house, and uh, during the when I made that statement, there was uh, the chairperson in the chat. There were uh, the Home Minister was there in the house. The BJP members were there, Alliance partners were there, and so many other people were there. And this uh, this uh, specific topic, I already 
already used it before also in my uh, parliament speeches. You can go to the records and see the old house of the parliament was uh, one and a half years before during some other session. So it is not a controversial statement. If it was to be uh, said as a controversial statement, it would have been brought up then. Maybe now it touches some person something and it is only after you speak and come that people find it it is a debatable and this thing. I think maybe I will try to avoid it next time and I will try to use some other words to mention that what I really meant to say that where the BJP is strong and getting their votes and this thing is. So that is what is the main this thing about. Do you think your comments is hurt the sentiments? No, no see, not? no. Uh, nobody has come and told me so far that it is thing. It's just that you are coming and asking me what it is and this thing. I'm just telling you what it is. And there was no nothing controversial or nothing in the house also which was thing. If it was uh, because uh, uh, parliament represents members from throughout India from different cultures, different religion, different uh, this thing, uh, states inside the parliament. So when it didn't raise something inside over there, uh, things can be discussed and things can be debatable outside. So maybe next time when it, if people find it really this thing, I will next time come and uh, try to use some other word in the, when I try to convey this thing. What you are referring to mention Gaumutra uh, and the BJP? Yeah, see the ideologies of different different parties are different and where the BJP is strong at and it's winning and elections is where they concentrate is the Hindi, the central of India which we call is uh, the Hindi heartbelt. So that is what I meant in when I mentioned that and where it is difficult for them to penetrate it onto the south of India because uh, as and as they have uh, since the discussion was about Jammu and Kashmir where it was the first time that a state has been converted into a union territory so it was there that I mentioned that it is difficult for them to come and to enter into the four states of uh, uh, the southern states and if it, if they want to really come in you should be uh, converting these four states into union territory and can uh, have control through governors that is what uh, the crux of the matter was subscribe to midday India Get direct notifications on all our videos by clicking on the bell icon.